Welcome to Routing and Switching Essentials. This is Packet Tracer Lab 2.2.4.10 Troubleshooting Switch Port Security. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to disconnect our laptop and we're going to connect it back to PC1. And you're going to notice, first of all, it's read straight across. So, why is that? Let's go ahead and hop on, switch one all over to the CLI. First thing that you'll notice is it is changed to an up status. So, we should be all good. So, let's go ahead and log into it by enable. And let's do a show IP and you know what? Let's do a show interface. Let's look at interface FA0 slash 1. That happens to be the one where PC1 is attached. Administratively down, line protocol down or disabled. So that's a good way of letting us know that there's something wrong going on. Probably has something to do with the port security. So let's go and do show, show port security. Let's look at the interface. So show port security interface. Let's look at that and interface. You're going to know. Notice that port security is set to disable. Its current status is secure down. Violation mode is shut down. So that lets us know that that guy is down. It is in a disabled state. It's in a secure down state. So let's go ahead and log in. And let's see what happened. What can we do with it? Configure terminal. Let's hop over to that interface. FA0 slash 1. Let's do a no shut. So we changed it to up. Let's see what happens. I'm going to go back. I'm going to go ahead and do the same two show commands that I did before. I want to show the interface. It is up and up. I want to see the show interface portion. Port security is set to disable. Violation mode is secure shutdown. And the violation mode is shutdown. Or the port status is secured shutdown. So let's go ahead and double check. See if we can ping between the PCs. The IP address of PC1 is 10, 10, 10, 10. Let's hop over to PC2. Let's try ping in that address. Ping 10.10.10.10. It is responsive now. It learned the MAC address of PC1. Now if we were to unplug PC1 and plug it into the home laptop, it may learn it, it may not. All depends on how many MAC addresses switch one, specifically port FA01 on switch one, is capable of learning. That's it for this lab, so thank you very much.